Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we have got these four rectangles as you can see in this figure such that the area of this yellow rectangle is 10. For this purple rectangle is 18. For this blue 14. And now we are going to calculate the area of this green rectangle. And moreover, the side lengths of these rectangles are given as 2, 3, 4, 5, and 4 as well. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's our very first step. Let's go ahead and focus on this yellow rectangle. And we know that this side of this rectangle is 3 and this is 2. Let's focus on this uh, shaded part of this yellow rectangle with side lengths 2 and 3. And here's the area of a rectangle formula. Area equals to length time width. In our case, this length is 3 and width is 2. So area turns out to be 6 square units. Thus the area of this shaded yellow rectangle turns out to be 6. And we know that the total area of this uh, yellow rectangle is 10. So this part, the unshaded part is going to be 4. And we know that this side length is 2. So this side length is going to be 2 as well. And since the area is 4, so that means this other side length is going to be a 2 as well. Because 2 times 2 is going to be a 4 as our area. If this one is 2, then these all sides are going to be 2 as well. And now let's focus on this purple rectangle and we know that this whole side length of this purple rectangle is 4 plus 2 is going to be 6 so that means this side length is 6 and since the area of this purple rectangle is 18 and we know the area is length time width if this is 6 so this side has got to be 3 because 3 times 6 is going to give us 18. So if this side length is 3, then this side length has got to be 3 as well. Now let's focus on this blue rectangle. We know that this side length is 2. Then this side length is going to be 2 as well. And now let's focus on this blue shaded rectangle over here. This side length is 4 and this side length is 2. And here's the area of a rectangle formula once again. Area equal to length time width. So let's find the area of this shaded blue rectangle. So that is going to be A equals to 4 times 2 is going to be 8 square units. Thus the area of this shaded part turns out to be 8. And we know that the total area of this blue rectangle is 14. If this is 8, the rest of this one unshaded part is going to be 6. And now we know that the area of this unshaded part is 6. This side is 2. Then this other side of this unshaded rectangle has got to be 3. Because 3 times 2 is going to give us 6 as an area. And finally let's focus on this green rectangle now. This side length is going to be simply 5 plus 3 that is going to make 8 so this side is 8 and this side length is 3 so the length of this green rectangle turns out to be 8 and the width is 3 so the area of this green rectangle is going to be 8 times 3 is going to be 20 
4. So thus the area of this green rectangle turns out to be 24 square units and that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.